What is going on guys and welcome back to another video. My name is Sparkman. Today I'm gonna try this uh, Godo or Godot. Is it Godot or Godo? I have no idea. Leave a comment down below and let me know. And I, I believe this game engine eventually will replace uh, Unity. And um, for the simple fact that I believe that uh, Unity is gone too mainstream. If you went to the Unity website now, uh, you can see that their main focus is not indie game developers anymore. And they have made it very clear that um, their main target now is, um, believe it or not, animation, uh, filmmaking, uh, AAA games. Yeah, Unity's become more commercialized, which is not a bad thing. I mean, uh, I believe that was their goal to begin with. I started using Unity when they first came out. It was around 2006, and they have done pretty good ever since. Uh, they were pretty successful at grabbing the attention of the uh, indie game developer. And I believe this is happening all over again with um, Godo or Godat. It's a Godat. They should really post the name of this game engine up there. Uh, one of the first things that you want to do when you first create a game engine is that um, not name it Unity at first because uh, uh, when there was no Unity, uh, if you type Unity on, on Google, you will get um, the definition of Unity, which was like being united, I guess. <laughs> I think you got a lot of church stuff when you first, um, when you search for um, Unity. Yeah, you wanna you wanna give your game engine a good name, okay? And I think this is why one of the reasons uh, Game Maker Studio has been uh, very successful, uh, and it's because of the name, okay? Game Maker, very specific, as opposed to stupid names like Click Team Fusion, okay? Uh, it might be an easy game engine, but it does have a pretty stupid name. But come on, let's just let's just be honest, okay? Um, Click Team Fusion, like, come on. I would have called it something else. Construct, um, I'm kind of great on that one. Uh, great names are like Unreal Engine 4. Okay, that that sounds that sounds even cool, right? And uh, you compare that to um, Crystal Tools, Empty Framework, Fire, in <laughs> Dunia, <laughs> Frostbite, Voxel Space, Copper Cube. Euphoria, Cry Engine. So anyways, I strongly believe this will eventually replace uh, Unity. All right, mark my words. And uh, as I mentioned, it's because I believe Unity has gone way too mainstream. But that's not to say that Unity is not good. Unity is actually pretty good. But if you went right now and you try to download Unity, uh, now you even have to sign in to use the game engine. Like 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 WTF? Um, you also and also the um, game engine is unnecessarily huge now. Like I I don't know is it like four gigs to download now? I I don't know I'm not sure. I just reinstalled Windows on this. I have, I haven't even downloaded um, uh, Unity yet, which I should probably do right now. First, I'm gonna post a couple of uh, Godo tutorials. See how how they go and if they. They do well, well, uh, I'll keep posting more. I'm actually recording a new uh, GDevelop video right now, so I'm going to get back at that, and um, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to smack the like button down below and subscribe. See you in the next video. Bye now.